72 but I will su suggest today I am reading and listening morning with number was 13 or 14. We cannot read one page. It is sadhak deha, sadhana, but it's, I cannot, we cannot complete from two days one page. Mm -hmm. So, what type of thing you want to do? Sadhak deha is fixed, then Siddha deha goes. If my Sadhak deha sadhana is not fixed, what, how I will enter in Siddha deha? Understand? Outside has to be fixed nicely. Then we can enter inside. And inside, outside is not fixed. I have too much problem, then how I will go inside? Understand? Then I close. No, then it's noisy. I don't remember, but I did put it like this. But you are reading it. Verse 72 from Sri Sri Radha Rasa Sivani. May Shri Radhika, who creates millions of cupids with her restless, playful glances, that are with the very proud twanging. A big trembling bow. Who is in the first beginning of her youth. And who is an astonishing and a stream of sweetness. May she be our mistress. Kishori, what is the meaning of this? You are translating. Again, listen. Oh, yeah, I'm going to play it. Listen. Well, I don't know what's going on. I'm not. That's so nice. Gurudev, uh, I don't hear anything. Now you will hear, I am talking with someone. Now it's okay. Read. May Sri Radhika, who creates 
millions of cupids with her restless playful glances. So he is the, he is the creator of cupids. He is the mother of cupids. No? She creates. Only by glance. In the rest of the playful, restless madness of Krishna, but his lover, madness, she created the Cupid. There are two Cupid. One is a material Cupid. Who see through false ego, and one is the spiritual cupid, and she create that experience. Is she creator? By looking restless eyes, the divine cupid. Forget his supremacy and he start dancing. Rasa vichar, Tattva vichar. Krishna's son is beautiful. Avimanyu, what is the name? Pardimna was beautiful. Tattva vichar and Rasa vichar. She creates millions of cupid by her restless eyes to make mad to the controller of the universe. Glances are like like the fairy crowd. Big trembling bowl. Radhika is in the first beginning of her youth. And it's an astonishing. Our mistress. There are plenty of people who know how to take something from Krishna. But how many people know how to give to ah. yeah. There are plenty of people who know. Clear now? Radha Guru Dev, still there is a lot of wind on the microphone. We cannot hear. Is it is it okay now? Yeah, now it sounds better. Should I read the verse again? One more time. Yeah, yeah, thank you. 
कमेंट पिक्चर मैं श्री राधिका हु क्रिएट्स मिलियंस ऑफ क्यूपिट्स With her restless, playful glances, that are like the very proud twanging of a big trembling bow. Who is in the first beginning of her youth, and who is an astonishing, endless stream of sweetness? May she be our mistress. There are plenty of people who know how to take something from Krishna but how many people know how to give to him Yeah what thing <laughs> What you thinking to take something from krishna or to give something to krishna all is thinking to take something blessing from him to remove my difficulties my problem right when the day will come that i want to give to him that is start love right or taking is start love then i see that he is a god i will take from him this is my hope to be related with you when he is my so many lover i want to give everything to him i want to serve him. how i will learn how to give him i cannot learn to give him without taking shelter of god because she gives to krishna she never take anything from him. this is a unconditional love in any circumstances she want to give what you want i will give to you that is divine that is the purity and its spirituality give and take is a business shop marketing no relation impersonal then we want to take from you okay good price i want to take from you. in love 
if I will cheat it, I will be in love, I want to give it. That is the meaning of love. I feel lucky to cheat it by her and love never cheat. Uh, cheated. Is the pure never happening like He gave, she creates the cupid. So that is the one point of the creating madness. He cannot understand, whole world is asking for me, and he wants to give me everything. What I think she gave, so she said, I want to be your student. I want to learn from you. How you got this mood? From where you got it? Sorry that you have to say, I say, little I prepare, then you will be, you start flowing, huh? you go on, yeah. So there are plenty of people who know how to take something from Krishna, but how many people know how to give to him? Yeah. Only the people of Raja who are love personified know it. Only people of Raja means who accept one mallow. Accept the mallow, give me the mic. One mallow is mother mallow. Become mother, mother give all. Me. She never expect from the child that he will care to me. She give, 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 give. Till her birth, last birth. Right or not? See that. Although she is in difficulty, but when the child is in difficulty, she want to give His voice is there? Yeah? Yes, Gurudev, we can hear you. Yeah. Oh. So giving. When the love starts, you give. When relation starts, you give. This giving tendency is a Radha Rani shelter, shelter of Mahabhav. How some feelings are good. Mm. 
material thing it's not valuable because i got the feeling to realize it and out of expectation i never had the feeling to understand this feel bahav this understanding was not clear in my life love is to give love is to feel so she is teaching us how to feel and give so uh, only the people of raja who are love personified know it giridhari lifts govardhana hill but mother jashoda does not forget about his meals ah you see that what child mm-hmm. and a giridhari took the mountain for his friends mother and all brother was he want to take all the pain on his finger to protect her this is also giving is okay going on She tells to Nanda Maharaj, "Oh ho, why don't you hold this mountain for a while, so that I can breastfeed my Gopal a little?" Ah, see, yeah, yeah, ho, are. Take the mountain out of you, India. I can eat my bird, my lala. <laughs> lala. Giving <laughs> always tendency to give. Ba. She radical things. Oh creator, how much you have blessed me by making it necessary for Priya Tama to carry this mountain so that I can see him constantly. and she prays to giriraj don't be too heavy for this tender boy to carry even though krishna clearly shows his divine prowess during this pastime the vraja passes experience only his sweetness they have forgotten everything about wanting and taking and they are only absorbed in thoughts of giving one accepts the mood of the copies in order to be able to give up thoughts of taking and asking and to learn how to think only about how to give that is the meaning of gopi
when this tendency comes to it. I have one question. When uh, we read in Vilapa that Tulasi Manjari is asking, oh, when will you give me the remnants of your food or something? What does she want to give then to Radharani? The food. What she is asking from Radhika to take blessing up. She is not asking even. She is feeding herself that she will take. She put in the she see everything and she put in the lift. From his lips to his to see Manjari lips. This is the mercy. She never asked any place for me. She is paid and she put in the mouth to mouth. Because she see the confidence of her and service. And kind and always fit in the service. Then she do this. We every day ask, give mercy, but she is not giving because my mind is different. Let's fix. She gave the person so who took the mood of Manjari and who to really become Radhantas. And really, she is following her. Other, they are every day asking, but nothing happening. Because we are missing the goal. We, of our movement is wrong place. Our goal is different. Search the line and show me that she is asking for the prasad of Radhika. Never. She is living in that. She no ask me to ask. She washed the feet and drink that water. She is always like a shadow to her. Radhika take care of them. <laughs> Manjari. And Manjari say, why are you bothering? I am with you now. Why you bother Radhika? I will take care of her. This. What you say in Hindi? Say that. I want to know very right. Gopina say in Hindi. The uh, other day we were listening on, uh, when another uh, goes on Abhisar and um, suddenly she becomes fearful. She's looking around, she stops, she looks into Tulsi's eyes and Tulsi Manji looks into her eyes and she says, in Hindi I say first, she says, means that she says, why are you stopping, my Swamini? Go on, I'm with you. Don't you worry. You have to go to the Kunja. If you don't go to the Kunja, then how will the Rasila 
be fulfilled today? How will we have the bliss today? So don't you worry, I'm always with you. You see, she said, you don't need to bother. You don't need to bother. I will bother for you. <laughs> this is that. Love. There's one more thing when uh, I was just feeling when Mother Ani gives her remnants to Tulsi Manjari. It's also that only the Manjaris can relish the intimate pastimes. And uh, one might keep. nobody else can relish the Kunja Leela. So Radha and, and Mohan need the Manjaris to relish this, also to share it. So this is also why they give the remnants to them because the Manjari know what happened in the past time. So when the Manjaris get the clothes or the, the food remnants, it uh, also means that they understand what happened in the Leela. Only one talking mic. Yeah. No, I don't mean. You have to come at once to fix it. No disturbance, I know. My bow go out. One accepts the mood of the gopis in order to be able to give up thoughts of taking and asking and to learn how to think only about how to give. Shirada only thinks of Mohana's happiness and the maidservant thinks only of the happiness of Yoga Lakishore. In the previous verse, Sri Pada in Sada Kavesh experienced the sweetness of Srimati's knitted eyebrows. And in this verse, he sees the sweetness of her sidelong glances. One single glance can enchant Mohana completely. In Sadak ways, this has to be meditated when we are in sadhana ways and go to see my sister there, Diti, Radha and Krishna. What to do? Read again. In the previous verse in Sadhana Vesh, Sri Pada experienced the sweetness of Srimati's knitted eyebrows. That to what? To your issue. How is eyebrow? 
साधक वेद एंड इन दिस वर्स ही सीज द स्वीटनेस of her side long glances and he sees sweetness of side long glance also this is the oneness that we can feel it in sadhak ways also She was the desire of the to see Manju. This is the desire of Raghunath Das Goswami in Sadhguru. one single glance can enchant mohana completely radhika's glance has the power of the arrows of millions of cupids and agitates even mohana who is himself the transcendental youthful cupid of vrindavan one is a material cupid one is a transcendental when we see the transcendental cupid it coming from my chitta bhakti my my sarup and when i see the matran with material cupid it come from my false ego material cupid running for the bit <laughs> i was so rascal that i don't know transcendental cupid is also there by all of your association i got it must see to understand before i was running for on the material cupid with my karmendriya and gyanendriya and my mind is influenced with the false ego this was my condition and i think we are all affected with that without meditating in our sarup avesh in istidev not possible to change वृंदावन में अप्रकृत नाविन मादन काम गायत्री काम बीज जहार उपासन चैतन्य चिंतन प्लीज एक्सप्लेन जनंद महाराज रीड अगेन वृंदावन अप्रकृत नवीन मादन काम गायत्री काम बीज 
ಜಹರ ಉಪಾಸನ So Brindavan there is a Brindavan in in a Brindavan there is a say uh, a apakrita apa apakrita eh can i say something yes gurudev this gopal mantra mm. what ends with gopi janavallava mm. that is the key point means mm. gopi janavallava the day you understand you understand your constitutional mm. position <laughs> i like krishna because of he is gopi janavallava he is dear mm. to the gopis narayan maharaj say the first word is from mother mother lila govinda second word is for the friendly are govinda all the friends say. and the third word is for the gopi gopi janavallava so we have to follow what gopis beloved krishna who is the beloved of gopi that krishna who is always navi new and beautiful and smart in the eyes of gopi and he dance for chachiya var chach pe nach na jaave for the some one cup of butter milk he start dancing to please gopi this krishna and this love of krishna make him supreme lord that he is so great no one can do like and the kama gayatri if you read the 16 of vilap kusumanjali you understand what the how the helping manjaris to the radha and krishna to make both of them happy not easy to explain that one need to understand and understand that divine feeling of that so usually gurudev <laughs> usually kama gayatri krishna has five arrows to to attract a uh, 
ブラジャ橋エスペシャリブラジャゴーピー But but here mentioned ラダラに has a special special arrows and eyebrows and actually some grants that's ラダラに s アローズ。And、uh, actually, クリシナアトラクトブラジャゴーピー and サキ。But ラダラニアトラクト even マダナ。Yeah. クリシナ。<笑>クリシナイズスープリムロード。そうクリシナアトラクトオールリビングエンティティ。including ブラジャーバシー and ブラジャーゴーピー。But if we see ラサビチャラ、シュリマテラサラニ、has a special feeling with マハバーバ。Yeah. <laughs> She even attract マダナ、ディバインキューピッド。<laughs> <laughs> Cupid has no activeness. He l o s e all his senses. <laughs> Why should he come? And Radhika is telling, Oh, my dear Tulsi, help him that he can wake up again. He is in the coat of sleeping coat. <laughs> help him to wake up that he can. Put some arrow, <laughs> but he cannot. Beautiful mantra, Mahaprabhu Mercy, we receive it. We chant, it tastes come. My Radha Mohan Baba, he chant 12 years only, Kama g a t i Kama Gatri, 12 years non stop, he is chanting. You can imagine how he was Siddha. Deep meaning. How much you want to go deep, you can go in. Yes, good day.、Huh? Go on, read. Now you explain my age.、Hmm. And other who like to share. Vrindavane <laughs> Aprakrita. Navina Madana Kama Gayatri Kama Bije Yahara Upasana How sweet is Srimati's puberty? Shirupa Goswami teaches us. Rupam Kim Api Anirva Cham Tanur Madhuryam Uchate Madhurya means some indescribable physical appearance. How many streams of astonishment! Are caused by Srimati's 
indescribable sweetness as she enters the first stage of youth. <laughs> so Guru Dev, it is said, Lasa. What is Lasa? This is Anantata Baba say, Lasa is kind of something astonishing and something divine. <laughs> So, Srimati Radhika's appearance is completely astonishing and uh, so beautiful. Krishna become uh, Krishna was automatically attracted. Actually, add boot. So we could not, we cannot say by words. Krishna is sometimes trembling, sometimes Krishna lose words, sometimes Krishna is kind of fainting. This is <laughs> Radharani's Madhurya, beauty, physical <laughs> beauty. Along with adolescence, the powerful King Cupid enters her childlike body, making her buttocks and her breasts grow and her waist become slender. Her eyes become naughty and her steps become restless. If the beginning of Shimati's adolescence is already so astonishing, then what to speak of her full adolescence. All these things can only be experienced in Swarupavesh. Absorption in consciousness of one's eternal spiritual body and not as long as one is in gross or subtle bodily consciousness. Astonishment equals rasa. According to Srila Kavi Karnapur, some people ask why do the followers of the Gaudiya Vaishnava tradition? not call Radharani mother. If she is Lord Krishna's consort, <coughs> then she must be the mother of the world. What is the harm in calling her mother? The answer is as follows. There are two ways of seeing God. 
One way is called tattva or spiritual truth and the other is called rasa or spiritual flavor. From the tattva point of view, Krishna is everything. He is all pervading and he is truth and knowledge personified. From the rasa point of view, he is full of love, full of nectar and full of pastimes. From the tattva point of view, he is blissful in himself. He has all his desires fulfilled. He is without hunger and thirst. And from the rasa point of view, he is always hungry and thirsty for the love of his devotees. Although these characteristics seem to contradict each other, they become compatible because of the Lord's inconceivable potency. One can relish the rasa based on the firm foundation of tattva. The Lord's manifestation in Vrindavana is the form of all nectarian mellows and rasa is mostly experienced there. Rasa is like the moss, the, the, the moss that covers a huge lake of tattva. In Raja, devotees forget Krishna's divine prowess and consider him Lokika Sadbandhu. Wow, explain this. Narayan Maharaj always explained. Jananda Maharaj. <laughs> so, in in Vaikuntha, uh, the devotee was attracted by his power and uh, opulence. Then some feeling is coming. Feeling is some awe and reverence. But uh, if our relationship become more strong due to our Baba, uh, spiritual uh, feeling. And then <laughs> that love become very strong. Then, especially Brajabashi, forget Krishna is the Supreme Lord. <laughs> so, Brajabas is thinking, oh Krishna's my son, Krishna is my friend, and Krishna's my lover. So, in Vaikuntha, we may say, uh, Lakshmiji is maybe some some kind of mother or some kind of queen. 
But uh, our manjari is loving feeling is very strong, but uh, try to uh, cooperate with Lada. And uh, we want to want to serve in Tatwa one has to be higher and other has to rest to prayer. One has to adore and other has to be follower of adoring. That is Tattva I want to adore someone. And then I never develop relation with that. How you can adore the person who is king, how you will develop relation with him. Impossible. You can adore and you respect and go out. You cannot sit near to that person. You cannot make the friendship with the king. You have to live in the etiquette. And even the mother cannot feed the breast because she is the higher than mother. She, mother has to adore like a Devaki. Devaki mother was there. He is praying to the Devaki that I, I want son like a Narayan. And when he appears, she cannot feed the breast because there is a tattva visha. There is no rasa visha. But mother Jasuda has only rasa visha, no tattva visha. So Krishna thinks to be a, like a human, I will come this time. I will appear from Goloka now to rasa visha to play with all my devotees and live in the rasa. So he appeared for that, to play like a friend, like a mother, like a lover. And that want to try to help this way. There is no adoring business. Like a Narayan, you adore, you cannot touch him. This is the Krishna. <laughs> Naravadali, human like a human, he also feel, he also become hungry, he also feel heat, he also sweating, he also need fan, he need also light, he need the same thing what I like. He also thirsty with water. He also need juice. He need also ice cream. <laughs> when he is a baby, he also need toffee to eat, rasgulla to eat. He need makar misri to eat. He go to the stealing to the home of father who has the butter. So this is a Naravad, the human, like a human, he do the part. Hmm. Not like a god, not like a Narayan. He is not interested for adoring my followers adore me. 
He loves me like I want. That is making Krishna proud in Krishna. This is teaching of Narayan Maharaj. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so in Bracha, the devotee forgets Krishna's divine prowess and considers him the Loki Kasat Bandhu. Yeah. <laughs> Are they like my son, friend? Mother said, My son. He is not a god. Who said this? He is a cowboy. My the friends say, "Oh, he is my friend. I am horse. I make horse to him, and I am riding on him." He is not a god. The good worldly friend, son or lover. And Krishna res reciprocates ah, with that's these. That's the beauty of this Krishna, not the Krishna. <laughs> then he behaves same way. The Gaudiya Vaishnavas strongly prefer the loving service of Radha over that of Krishna mm -hmm. and want to serve her as manjaris, ah. spiritual handmaids. Wow. The spiritual? Handmaid. It's a maidservant. Mad, mad, mad. I want to be mad. Although Chaitanya Charitamrita includes statements like Sarva Palika Sarva Jaga Teramata, Radha is everyone's protectress and she is the mother of the whole world, the parental relationship is not compatible with the amorous relationships. And therefore, the words Mother Radharani cannot be heard from the mouths of the Kodiya Vaishnavas. With the melting heart of an associate of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Sripada says, Bhavatuna Sri Radhika Swamini, let Radhika be our mistress. It's the end of verse 72. Yeah, oh. Anyone want to comment? Then Jananda Maharaj will come prove that. Anyone to say something? Here and Jananda Maharaj will come. Which number morning we are reading? From three days? Fourteen we are reading. Read that. Sadak Deha, how to do sadhana? 
We are sadak they have. Without making sadak they have perfect, no way to enter into the day. Three days Gaura Chandra want to teach us. Jai Ho. Chandra. We cannot finish it. Three days it's going on. One paragraph we blocked. We are calculating ourselves where we are doing mistake and how to improve it. You yeah, see? Purple is very long of this verse. We are a little stuck like this. Radhe. Yeah, the purport is uh, quite long of, I think, verse four, 13 and 14. We are since some days in that only. So, yeah. I want to respond to Jayananda telling how the sidelong glance of Radharani makes Krishna faint and her knitting eyebrows can control him fully. And then from the purport of Anantadas Babaji, something came in my mind that was so beautiful what Anantadas Baba is writing. So we listen that all the yogis and like Narada, they try to reach to Krishna, but they have difficulties to even have the darshan of his lotus feet, what to speak of the normal jivas. So Anantadas Baba is writing that Krishna, actually he is the shelter of the whole world. But Radharani is the shelter of Krishna. He takes shelter in her. But the Manjari is the shelter even of Radharani. When they go on Abhisa, what Gopinath explained before, Radharani is fully dependent on the help of the Manjari. She trusts her Manjari so fully that she takes the guidance and needs the help because in the dark night, in the forest, with the wild animals, with strong desire and excitement to meet Mohan. So she is worried, watching all around and cannot find the way alone. So Tulasi is telling her, don't bother. I take care of you. <laughs> so Krishna is the shelter of the whole world. Radharani is the shelter of Krishna and the Manjari is the shelter of Radharani. Jai Ho, Radhe Radhe. That was very beautiful, really. Jai Anantaras Babaji Ki Jai. Jai. It, it even goes further, no? That also Krishna is dependent on the manjaris. No? Wow. Yes. Yeah. Some part time. There is also uh, one beautiful pastime, what Gorachandra was just mentioning when Radha goes to Abhisar and she's fully covered in white sandal paste and her ornaments and her white dress are all blending with the moon. So Tulsi and the Manjaris take Radha to the Kunja and Krishna Mohan is waiting already, but he doesn't see her. She's fully blended with the moon. And then Tulsi puts Radha Rani's hand into Mohan's hand and says, take her, here she is. And then when we were listening to this pastime, this feeling came that even Krishna cannot do without the manjuris. He also has to take shelter. He didn't recognize her, 
But the manager has told her that she's here now. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh. They are so rustic. They, I have no way to escape from this. <laughs> <laughs> Gurudev, you're infusing. No, no, you're I infusing. don't know. I haven't. Mm -hmm. I'm a still a student and I, mm -hmm. I have no idea. But by your grace, all of your grace, I forget Tattva Vichar, Rasa Vichar. From two days, Gaurav Chandra is telling about this that I remember Tattva Vichar and Rasa Vichar. I forget Tattva Vichar and Rasa Vichar. And now you see Anandasva when you say Tattva Vichar and Rasa Vichar. Radhe Radhe. Radhe Radhe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Dandavat Pranam. Dandavat Pranam. We say, we read in the verse that, um, that Radhika creates a million cupids. Yeah. But Guru, is this, is it not what Guru Dev does to create out of us a million cupids? You're turning the devotees into a million lovers. Explain. What is uh, what? What is the reason? What what is there? So, Udav uh, Bayer is uh, saying the guru that that. Uh, what we not explaining? No, I'm I'm just repeating guru so that you can explain to us that uh, guru creates lovers for the divine. So Radharani creates millions of cupids and Guru is creating millions of lovers. Yes. Right. Did I get it right, Uda? <laughs> yes, that's what it is. Right. We are Radha Dasi. Mm -hmm. We give the bhava. Bhava means feeling. This feeling brings us to Radha, to Mahabha. What we miss in material life, we lose to feel something. When the feeling comes, then tears come. When the tears come, that is the feeling tears is the more fortunate time in our life. And these tears make us so pure to realize the, what is the beauty of the feeling. Say so, Yeah. Guru, you were saying today, we, if, like, we are soul, but can the soul love? Uh, that's the problem of the soul. Soul can be God because it's, the soul is a condition. Prabhupada said, take the Bhagavad Gita last chapter. Soul is a condition. Marginal because condition because of the senses, body and false ego. These are the condition of the soul. So I even not think for the soul. I am so conditioned. And ping pong marginal. If anyhow we will start to do, become religious devotees, religious outside. Religious means outside. Inside is a spiritual. When I want to be religious, then ping pong. Sometimes I'm so that I'm a very good person. And again, the desire to be go out. 
to water and to take the other ideas, material things also. So both never go ping pong. And independency also is there. Because God is independent, super soul is independent. And sometimes we don't only want to be independent, we want to be condition, independent. And I want to be God also. Because I see only God, super soul. So why not I so hum, I become God. Enjoy. I use independency of mercy of the Lord to become like Him. And to become enjoyer, real enjoyer. I not identify Him, I start identifying myself. But you ask honestly to realize the Guru. He will not say that I am a Guru. He will say, I am the student of my spiritual master. What he guide me, I do that. If somebody say, I become Guru, is no hopeless Guru. Because he cut the relation with his Guru there. If he become God, he cut the relation with the God, he become God. So that way, when we cut the relation, my spirituality is gone. My divine connection, I lose. It becomes long distance gone. A local call is not that. Local call can be only possible when we stay in my sarup identity. Soul is the base for sarup. And this not a Krishna mercy, this mercy of Alladani by his love, she, she sent her dasi, met servant to inspire this mercy to the jiva. And this dasi bring the masses of uh, what seva you have to do, what mood you have to do, what kunja you have to be with me. This is your response. Then Gurudev think this seva, this mood, which manjari has, then he select the manjari name, he select the dress like that, body color like that, and then we practice to reach that point. Right? This is the gift of Radhika. How the without her mercy she will accept us. She accept because she is blessed to her dasi to do this for me. I like this. This to bring him in my service. She become fit now. I divert some Yeah. Uh. Very, very natural, very practical. And this is the reason to, to practice. This was the Prabhupada gift 
प्रभुपाद टॉकिंग स्वरूप एंड स्वरूप सिद्धि स्वरूप एंड स्वरूप सिद्धि इज आवर कंस्टिट्यूशनल पोजिशन टू फिक्स टू गो बैक टू माई होम देर इज नो अदर वे टू गो बैक टू होम विदाउट नोइंग माई कंस्टिट्यूशनल पोजिशन इफ आई डोंट नो माई कंस्टिट्यूशनल पोजिशन अगेन आई विल कम इन द सर्किल ऑफ डेथ एंड बर्थ no way out to leave that self why he say back to home what he say back to god back back to god why back to the how i can back if i know my i don't know myself who will go back my material body will go back my ego will go back my senses will go back my relation will bring me back my loving exchange will bring me back i am so much a love living in this material body that you cannot leave me and i will not leave you this love can do love can do. only love can be yeah take care you need my share something yes sir do you have to my my ragunath baba want to share jai yeah. realize Hare Hare, my dears. <laughs> wow, so nice, so nice vibes here. <laughs> It's incredible. So, wow. so emotional. If you all could be here, I mean, you are here, but uh, to be here is very, very special. And yesterday, I was taking darshan, the last darshan from Dada Mohan. and uh i was looking at the altar and i only saw radha that was only radha and suddenly a play time revealed in my heart and that was that radha rani she was in a kuncha and she was walking around and thinking my where am i where is my tulsi where is my tulsi and uh and suddenly tulsi came through the door and stayed in front of radha with tears in her eyes and then radha was asking did you see my mohan did you see my mohan tulsi did you see my mohan where is my mohan and to see you you know you know you you met him right where 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 is my mohan where is my mohan and then to she said uh, i met him i met him in um, in nandishwar in uh, nandakram when i when i when i when i took the remnants to bring it to you and then she said and and how how was it how was it did he ask you something 
and Tulsi was quiet. And then Brother Rani told Tulsi, come here, come closer, come closer, come closer. And she looked into, into Tulsi's eyes. And then, then she said, she asked, what did he say? What did he say? And Tulsi said, with tears in her eyes, always flowing, totally in ecstasy, totally in feelings towards Radha and Swamini. And she said, you know what? He's asking me something through the eyes. Through his eyes, he was asking me if there is possible a meeting today, tonight. Can I meet my can I meet my my beloved? Can I be he was asking me through the eyes because there were superiors around. He could not ask it, he just had to ask through the eyes. And then Tulsi Tulsi also Tulsi also answered through the eyes to him, and she said, Yeah, it's possible. And this is what Radharani felt. That's why she was looking in the eyes of Tulsi that she, that, that she could see her Mohan. This is, this is like what Gopinath and Gorachanda shared before. The relation from the mantras is so incredible close that, yeah, it's, it's just, you know, it's just wonderful. It's just wonderful. I mean, what, what can be said? We can go into, into these feelings and and feel our Swamini so close and and taking shelter in her. And then we get from our Satak there, uh, Vesh outspoken now. Then we can take refuge in the shelter of of Radha's lotus feet, and then we can get normal again because we're all abnormal. You know that mm-hmm. we are totally abnormal. We still think that the material world is is something what is where we can find something. We can't find nothing. What means spirituality only through the guidance, only through the navigators, only through the contact with the deities, only through this we can find some relief to get out of that material world and then to connect like our Swaroop. And then everything is revealed. We don't have to read any more books, nothing. All this, all knowledge, forget it. So many books were written, but for what? If there are only two books important, that's at least my heart. I don't know what is yours, but this is only my 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 focus now, and um, I only can. I only what we learn from Radha Rasudaniji, and what we learn from Bilakutumanju. We learn from 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 Radha Rasudaniji. No voice is coming. That's my my feeling that. Is that to about Radharani and the relation from Radha to Mohan, and uh, it's a little bit like a mixture between Babu Lashradi and Sansneya. There's some some Gopi, uh, there's some Shaki mood also inside, but in Vilap Kujumanjari there's only Manchari mood. That is my feeling towards. These two books. And what is Manjari feeling? That you ask. The Manjari feeling is the Manjari feeling for me is that you only only want to take refuge in Radha's lotus feet. We have nothing anymore than her. Whole life I practice to Krishna. And what you said, new subject. <laughs> Whole life I practiced to follow Krishna, and in old age you said to follow this new subject. How I will do that? Yeah, you want me to ask? I do the answer. Yeah. 
I think there is, because it's still abnormal when we go towards Krishna, it's abnormal. It's not our real fulfillment. It's not our real Ananda. It's only one part of this whole story. There's, there's my object in, the object is Radha of my worship, of my wanting, of my love is 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 Radha. It's not it's not it's not Krishna. So what I feel is here is is very very deep. Babulash Radhi what means that is Manchari Bhav. That means totally one pointed. Atiksneya. Atiksneya means one pointed completely. And if there is then because we can we can feel about or we can we can see Mohan through Radha. Because if we are with Radha, Mohan automatically comes. <laughs> like this these play times which I just um, I just revealed because it was also revealed like this. So I revealed it to you and, and this is this is what is happening. We are automatically with with, when we are with Brada, Mohan comes automatically, but we don't want to, I personally tell you the truth. Maybe there was in the past some, some, some understanding of God, especially when you see Bhagavad Gita. Okay, in Bhagavad Gita, when you see that fourth verse, uh, in the fourth chapter, you see that he's, he comes to reestablish all the religious principles, everything and so on. What is, what is described there. And then he said, Savadama Parijaja. In the last part, that means at the beginning, he's like the king, the Narayan and the, the, the Aishwarya mood. And in the last part of Bhagavad Gita, Mohan is totally in love. And he tells it, Mam Ekam Sharanam Raja. He says, my only one. She's my only one. She's so beautiful. She's so wonderful. She's my only one. That is, so I don't, I, actually Mohan is also happy. He's very happy is Mohan when we are with Radha. This is real Krishna consciousness. That is, that is what I feel. What do you say, Chainanda Maharaj? So this oneness coming from Mahaprabhu through Gurudev. Therefore, <laughs> Gurudev could ex expand that feeling, which Uddhava Prabhu, Uddhava Prabhu saying, <laughs> Gurudev. So if this is Mahaprabhu Masi, this is Guru Gurudev, Guru Manjari's Masi. <laughs> That's what I just say. <laughs> Yeah, oh. our navigator is perfectly situated and he brings us right to the lotus feet of Radha Mohan, for sure. And his navigation is also in, in, intact because his navigator is also totally situated and so on. So we can go up till yeah, Nityananda. This is perfect navigation we got. And we can be very happy to have found that in our life because this gives real happiness. So, many years, like 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 Udo said now, but why? Why we were only about uh, talking about Krishna or hearing about Krishna? Because nobody explained us. The navigation was wrong. It's also this, because how, how can we find this real navigator? And there's one answer for me. That's an intense, intense desire to find real love, unconditional love. Then Radharani sends us all, the navigator, everything we need. She sends us, and then we can be rightly navigated. <laughs> so only eye contact. Is sufficient. Can you imagine? Only eye contact says everything. Yeah. 
Raja Rani looks in the eyes of Tulasi. You can really feel it. And then she says, wow, you have seen, you haven't seen him. Because they had eye contact and she still sees. I mean, what words can be spoken? Nothing. We only can feel it. This is a feeling which is so beautiful and so intense that there's no comparison anymore with nothing. Oh, yeah, this is what I just, sorry that I extended a little bit. That did, that did. Yeah. Thank you.